Just a little high. These are good. Touch your gloves. Let's get after it. Box. Oh, left hook and a right hand from Benjamin. And he puts Bacargo Ooh. in the spin cycle and down. And one draw. Second time he's been down, and it's going to be three pretty soon, it looks like. Unless he can hold on for the next 14 seconds. Let's see what Benjamin did, does wrong here. He's trying to escape the left hook right there. You see the, see him put the earmuffs on or the high guard. Boom, beautiful uppercut right between the guard of Cargo. You know, you see you have your opponent leaning forward. When you see him leaning over that front line or front of that front foot. It's the skill, it's the power, it's the speed of Dante Benjamin Jr. He lands a straight right hand, and then as he bounces off the rope, that right hand sends him down for good. Four, five, six. Body work now from Dante Benjamin Jr. Another left hand that sends Bro. McCargo reeling and down for the second time. These, didn't he? <laughs> oh, he needs to get a game from those gloves. Man, this is that, that's got to be a knockdown. Third knockdown of the fight. Ow, I mean, did he even land a punch? He just flopped on the floor. He landed on the body while he was catching the rule in effect. There's another right hand and a left hook. Smooth jazz here in a different type of, type of tune. He's hearing the bass from those gloves of Dante Benjamin Jr. And the fight is over. A technical knockout win. The latest knockout in the career of Dante Benjamin comes with seconds left in this second round. But let, let, let's take a look right here. I mean, Benjamin just getting aggressive. Lands a right hand, but it was more McCargo off balance right there. And then he goes down because he didn't want to get hit with a right hand. But he did hit him on the back of the head there. Yeah, but that shot right there, that hurt. That right on the chin. But check this out. I'm, I'm doing, well, you he the, ducked down. He look, ducked down. You, in the, you, in the, you, you are in a fight. Yeah. You're following up with your shots. You can't be worried about what position he's in and so on and so forth. You're going to let those hands go. That's the third knockdown, and this is how it ended. Again, 50-50 exchanges right here. Both guys swinging. Clipped them on high on the head right there. I don't know if that shot initially hurt him. I don't know. I'm not in his body, but it, it grazed him on the temple. He lost his balance and he, and he flopped to the floor. On the front. Interesting, front. brother. Interesting. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs>